Okay, for this demonstration, um, I'm not going to go over the next uh, W3 Schools gallery, but you could go and check it out. Also, there's a light box in there. I'm going to skip that one because we're going to do this light box, but you certainly could give this one a go if you wanted to. Tab gallery, I've already done that in a previous video. The, the image hover is kind of fun, so we'll go ahead and do that one. Again, back at the W3 Schools, <clears throat> and you've got two examples of image layover fade. You've got this example and this example. I'm going to do this example because basically you do them the same way. And <clears throat> they've done it a little bit differently. They don't give you the step-by-step, -step, but we're going to go to where it says try it yourself. We're going to copy that. And we're not going to copy all this because this includes the the HTML tag, the head tag. I'm going to create a new document, Dreamweaver. I'm going to save it right away. <clears throat> and I'll call it Image Hover and save. Again, I'm just doing this within a, the context of a blank page, but you could do the same thing if you've given it room somewhere on your document. So I'm going to get this out of the way, go back here, and I'm only going to copy the code that I need. So if I'm looking here, I can see the styles. And I'll grab them all, although I'm going to have to change something. And keep in mind, I am already getting the style tag. So if you already have the style tag, make sure that you don't duplicate it, and I'm referring to in a previous design document. <clears throat> in this particular case, I don't even have the style tag, so I'm just going to click after the title tag, make sure that I'm in the head tag, and I'm going to paste. <clears throat> now, if you've got another style sheet that has a container class, we're going to have to change that as well. And I actually will do that. So instead of dot container, I'll change the name to image container. Everywhere I see that I'm going to change it to image container and maybe I'll just also copy it so I don't type it wrong. Copy. I see container down here again. Paste. Do I have it anywhere else? I don't see it anywhere else. Okay. <clears throat> going back to this web page, I'm going to go down to the HTML tag. I'm going to you can decide whether you want the H2 in the paragraph tag. I'll go ahead and select them. You can always get rid of them later. And I want to make sure that I'm picking up div to div. Okay. Actually, the H2 to the div, the beginning of that div is right here. So I'm going to grab all this text and I'm going to copy it. Go back to Dreamweaver. In my body, I'm going to give myself a little bit of room and paste. Okay. Now it's not going to work right now because remember how I changed this class name? So I'm going to copy this, come back down, and you don't have the period in here, so don't pick up that period and don't want that extra R. Okay. Now next I could come in here and I could change this text to whatever I want it to be. I'll just say Jackie. <clears throat> And I don't have a working image. So instead of image underscore avatar, I'm going to go quote to quote, hit my delete key, new quote, browse to my image folder. Um, I'll just go to my regular image folder and I'll pick up this one. Okay, there you go. Now the image is too big for this container, so I want to have to I'd want to readjust that. So I'm going to go back to Dreamweaver. And I need to adjust that container, that my container, that style. So I'm coming up here. Instead of the width being 50%, I could actually change it to um, a certain height and width. And that image actually is 235, so I'm going to go to my style sheet. Oop, i got to click the styles. Got to go to my style sheet. 
And instead of percentage, I'm going to change it to the exact size, which is 235 by 235 px. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and maybe I'll even move this here. Go ahead and preview again. And there we go. I definitely would want to move that, that text box around. All right, pretty easy.